I'm Kia Malone reporting from Capital Dance Board 2016 with the organizer, co-organizer. Thank you, yes. Yes, because Marianne would be <laughs> very right. upset with you That's for, right. <laughs> for me saying that. My wife is the organizer. I am the co-organizer. That's right. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but he is also the man in front of the camera at the moment mm -hmm. with the big welcome to Capital Dance Board. That's right. Welcome to Capital Dance Board Championships. I'm John Zapama, your co-organizer and co-host for this year's event. And it's 20 years. I can't yes. believe it. It's 20 years. Congratulations on Thank that. You. Thank That's you big. So it's much. your platinum anniversary. I mean, I'm pretty sure it feels like the first time. You know what? Every year feels like the first time. Is that a song? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sorry. <laughs> no, it's true. You know, every year is new. Every year is different. It's got uh, a different energy. You're trying to do new things. And, uh, you know, some years work out really great. Some years you kind of go, okay, we're not going to do that again. But we'll, you know, whatever. So it's all good. All exciting. I know one of the things that um, you're kind of doing is going down memory lane with all the pictures around the ballroom. And, of course, you always have the beautiful photos from the competitions, you know, um, the previous year. But you have 20 years of photos from all these magnificent dancers. Yes, we do. You know, that was something that uh, Marianne and I on the outset wanted to do was we wanted to create a, a pictorial history of Capital Dance Sport. So uh, we've engaged a private photographer every year uh, since we started the event. And they we thumb our way through 1,200 pictures one year, 2,000 pictures another year or whatever, and try to choose uh, between 10 and 12 that uh, you know, tell a story or really emote a, an emotion, something that really inspires you when you see it. And uh, then we blow them up into posters and, uh, and we've built this gallery now and we're so excited to uh, be able to present that to everybody. So we've got some you know, really great people and icons in the industry that have uh, danced as uh, competitors here. So it's just really fantastic. We're they'll excited. walk into the ballroom and go, oh my gosh, I remember that. Or they'll go, oh my gosh, I remember that. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Well, we try to put them at their best when we, okay. when we immortalize them. Yeah, for sure. I know one of the things that you're doing uh, new this year, you're trying to include everyone and make it really convenient for everyone, especially for those of us who are parents. And, you know, we may need to bring the kids along. Mm -hmm. You've got something new this year for kids. We have the Capital Dance Sport Playroom. Love it. So That John uh, DePalma will be babysitting himself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, you bring your own nanny. Yes. <laughs> so uh, what we did was, you know, we've had such a baby boom uh, in the dance business. And so many of our uh, younger dancers are starting families. And they bring the kids with them. And, you know, it's a long day for the kids to be in the ballroom. And they're watching their parents and, and you know, on the floor. And they want to play and whatever. So uh, we created a space here in the uh, hotel and it's called the Capitol Playroom so we have a DVD player set up and a big screen and they can watch Little Mermaid and uh, we're finding Nemo and I, I you know I I, go. yeah you know I do too we said we all said we have a couple of movies that we want to finish watching this year but it's a uh, you know nice little space for the kids you know, to be able to go into an adult-free zone, and then the ballroom stays a, you know, a kid-free zone, and it kind of works out well for everybody that way. It's always a good, I mean, this is one of my favorite competitions. Thank I mean, it's you. a great venue, you know, great, a great location. Um, but it, it's always one of those things that it, it, it's very challenging. You know, you've got stiff competition coming in here every year, but then it also has this feel of uh, warmth, and it, it, it's not, intimidating. Does mm -hmm. that make sense? You know, it's just, it's a great place to be. Thank you. Thank you. I, I think that one of the most important things, you know, whether you're competing or whether you're dancing socially, you know, the main reason that everybody really starts doing it is because they want to have fun. And so we try to really filter that into the event. It should be fun and there should be cheering and there should be laughing. And, and that's important because that's really kind of what it's all about. It's not only the, the stiffness of the competition or the challenge of the competition, but I think it's also the camaraderie that dancing brings. And, uh, you know, we love it and we hope that everybody else loves it too. Well, certainly a good event, and a lot of people have been talking about how great it is to be here. So we will see as the week continues all the fun stuff. Awesome. Here with John De Palma, co-organizer of Capital Dance Board 2016. Thanks, everybody. We hope that you'll join us again for the rest of the week here. Thank you.